Continuing on with the glute medius muscle, so we're going to review the origins and insertions for that. So it comes off the outer middle portion of the ilium, and then it runs to the superior portion of the greater trochanter. Uh, it's also known as the deltoid of the hip because it does internal rotation, external rotation, and abduction depending what fibers you're looking at. So much like the anterior delt, the middle delt, and the posterior delt, same thing here at the hip. It can help internally rotate, externally rotate, as well as abduct the thigh in various motions. So for the muscle test for this, what we'll do is have the patient lie face up. And then what you're going to do is just flex the hip up just a little bit, even a little less than that. And then my force is going to be down and in. So hold there nice and strong. And what this is doing is primarily checking abduction of the thigh right up top here. So again, you can slowly load in and then slowly come off. So in this position, it's a nice long lever. I can generate a lot of force when I do a muscle test. However, if patient has knee problems, what we can do is go a little bit higher up the leg. So still in that same test position, support down here, and we can still do that same directional challenge of down and in towards the table and relax. For the side posture glute medius muscle test, we're going to Move the limb up in this position, bring it forward just a few degrees. I'm supporting his SI joint with my thigh back here, as well as on front with this hand. Again, we can do the muscle test below the knee here. However, if someone has knee problems or knee pain, we can slide above the knee. And what's really nice about this is we know this muscle inserts into the lateral thigh, and we can generate force with this muscle test, but you can also feel the iliotibial band contract right beneath my thumb and you can see all across here the tension develop through this muscle test. So it's actually a really good check at the same time to see if there's any problems along that iliotibial tract. In this sideline position, this variation right here where I'm contacting above the knee is a fantastic way to challenge the functional kinetic chain all the way down the lateral thigh.